Hello, 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 hello. This is Rich Kale here on YouTube, Rich Genix elsewhere, and it's time to complete continue with Deponia, the complete journey. We're still in the chaos in Deponia part. And now organized unorganized crime has managed to um, basically uh Alright, do I have Leo? No, I don't. Alright, I have nothing right now. Let me see what I have to do here. Alright, I got a rescue goal. I still don't know why nothing showed up over here. So if I have the job interview get Alright. What the fuck? Uh something just uh had a quick whatever happened all right so let's knock on the door what will you do what else i'm going in there now but the place is crawling with unorganized criminals i can handle them hey open up it's me rufus yes uh you who can i come in for a moment that won't work you can use the portal soon but first you have to do something for me. Here. What's this? Another remote? Yes, it's Liebold's. It seems to be an older model, but hey, I know how to use a remote. Liebold? Yeah, of course you do. Liebold is the fat one, right? I'm only asking because I haven't seen an implant. You can do it. When you're finished, you can use the portal. Then I'll explain everything. Huh? What portal? Trust me, and not a word to Janosch. Okay. Okay. So, uh, Leibold. Got left. Huh. I wonder what all these buttons do. Ah, I'll just push the biggest one. Yeah. And zap! Oh, look at me! I completed an important mission! Yeah, any monkey could have done that. This sucks. What the? Huh? Portal opened. You can't see it, but I swapped his mind for some reason. Okay, well, what's this? Wait. There you are at last. What took you so long? Just because you're from the past doesn't mean there's no need to hurry. Huh? What's going on here? Is that you, Cletus? Don't be silly. I'm your future self, of course. These portals are space-time curvatures. And this is the future. Da, 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 da. They, they call, call him Rufus. Rufus. Hey, that's my jingle. Mysterio. Not anymore. I'm more up-to-date. Wiser and way cooler than you. Is that so? Okay. Huh, I want proof. Yeah. All right. Anything to make you shut up. A simple test will show that you're nothing but a puffed up loudmouth. Or you, exactly. So, what am I thinking of right now? Okay. Okay. No, no, wait, wait. I remember now. You're thinking of Zeebel Zoobel. Ha! Missed it by a mile, you clown. Zeebel Zoobel. <laughs> that doesn't even make sense. You're an imposter. I knew that right away. No, I'm not. I had to say that so I wouldn't create a time paradox. Yeah, yeah right. Just admit that I won. Why? Why? What were you thinking of if it wasn't Zeebel Zoobel? Well, actually... It was... Uh, <clears throat> mm. Hey, <laughs> future me, old pal. There you are. How's that for a surprise? I told you so. Can we finally get going now? You need to go in there and rescue Gold. So she's really in there? Is she all right? Don't panic. Wink and Nod have been put out of action. What? You overwhelmed them both all by yourself? That was nothing. Looks like you're really me after all. How did you pull that off? Ah, you'll, you'll soon figure it out yourself. Meanwhile, 
I'm gonna take care of the rebels. Whoa, is that really a gun? No, it's a banana peeler. Of course it's a gun. Can okay. I try it? Not now. You're headed to the lab. You need to free goal, remember? Oh, yeah. All right. Oh, well, I'll go rescue Gold then. I'm sure I'll do it way cooler than you did, and she'll end up being much freer than she did with you. Please do it just as cool as I did, or I'm gonna dissolve. And that is really painful, you know? <laughs> Me like. Rufus! Yeah, yeah, I know. Spoil sports. But afterwards, I'll get the gun, right? Yes, sure! Him <clears throat> through the portal. Okay. And hurry, the clock's about to strike the hour here, and then the rebels will storm the office. Blah, blah, blah. Kill the media. Okay. <clears throat> Doc! Goal! You're alive! What's going on? Rufus? What are you doing? Uh, just chilling. Killing? Bite out his eyes! That might not be necessary this time, boss. It's Rufus. He's one of us. What were you doing in Doc's asbestos cabinet? I, uh, uh needed some asbestos and uh, accidentally got myself locked up. Really? You gotta be careful. I lost two ants that way. But I'm glad you're here. We're trapped here. Some weird extremists are after our ascension codes. Your ascension codes? We were just about to add them to our corporate inventory. That's why we have this crowbar. If they don't leave soon, we'll be forced to shoot our way out. Shoot them all! Tabula Raza! Wait! I've got a plan! Get on with it then. Wink's trigger finger is getting all itchy. Blasted nickel allergy. Okay, so now we got to, uh... Play the rebels, play the unorganized crime, good god. Uh, this is gonna get tricky, isn't it? Yeah, it's gonna get tricky. Okay, I gotta talk to Doc here. Doc? Are you alright? Mm. Mm. Oh, right, the gag. Uh, there. Better now? Yes. Oh, peachy. Okay, then I can leave now, right? Yes. Well, you know, it's not like we couldn't use a little help. I see. This element on Donna's temple, is that also an implant? Yes, I mounted it myself. Why do uh, you ask? I think I have a plan. I recommend that you get a second opinion. You wouldn't happen to have a remote for Donna lying about. Hey, of course. I do have one, come to think of it. It should be in the drawer, over there. But you would have to get pretty close for it to work. Just leave that to me. Do I have a choice? Nope. Okay. <laughs> exactly happened yeah they came out of nowhere well actually they came through the door they just overwhelmed us and took us prisoner apparently they're after the ascension codes you think so well they did say things like where are the ascension codes and so on i tried to explain that we can't give them the codes right now they wouldn't listen all right let me try something i would cross my fingers for you but being tied up and all that no problem Hey, what the... Trust me, it's needed. So I need to get at the drawer? I mean, oh. Drawer. May I? <clears throat> Super. Two more remotes. Great. That should get things moving. Let's see. There's a label on the bottom of one. Hey, it says Donna. That should be useful. And on the other, ha, huh, well, hello. This is the remote that future Rufus gave me earlier, the one that belongs to Liebold. Obviously, I have a plan. I just don't know what it is yet. Yeah. All right. Talk to Gull now. Goal. Rufus, 
At last! You've got to get us out of here! I'm working on it. Work faster then! After all, you're the one who got me into this mess! Huh, so you're Lady Gold. And you are about to become Lady Rufus if you don't hurry up! All right. I found this remote. I think it belongs to Donna. What are you getting at? Well, if you would let me remove your cartridge for just a moment... Don't you dare! Mm. Wow! Doc keeps a bottle of champagne in his office. What? Where? Sorry, Goal. He'll thank me for this later. Okay. Uh, I hate doing that. Okay. Hey, what are you doing? Nice buddy. Although the eye patch might impede my aim. Don't! No, it's fine, actually. <laughs> Was that necessary? Did you have a better idea? Yes! Too late. Oh, well. One less worry, at least. Now all we have to do is subdue the rebels. All we need is a new... Don't say it. Plan. Oh. I can feel a flash of inspiration ambling in my general direction. Particles of ingenuity are wafting through the air. Hmm. Okay. Use vacuum cleaner engine with bubble gum? Perhaps later. Does it always have to be a complicated plan? I thought that's what you like about me. You seem to confuse me with spunky gold. Spunky goal, but of course. I've got Leibold's remote, right? Everything is slowly falling into place. My past self is going to insert Spunky goal in Leibold. She will then subdue Yanosh while I take care of Garleth. And voila, we're out of here. Past self? What are you talking about? Can't we just leave the same way you came in here? No, we can't. Because of the, the temporal coherence and the, and the spatial thingamy and, and, and so forth. It's complicated. Isn't it always? Uh, I'll explain it to you later. Now, we need to find Spunky Gold's cartridge. Here, might as well take this one. Hey, awesome! You're not half bad. Only one third, actually. Just trust me. You go free the others. I'll take care of the rebels. But first, I'm going to grab a gun. And I get Donna's remote. If it makes you happy. Oh, man. This is going to be so totally epic. Okay. Well, we did that. Ha, <laughs> ha. Finally, I've got a gun, too. Ha. And who's the better man now, huh? Stupid oh, future Rufus. Mm. All right. So we got the crowbar, and okay. All right. Hey! Open up! It's me, Rufus! Uh-oh, that must be me from the past. I should open up, otherwise I'll screw up causality. Okay. Yes! Uh, Yoo-hoo! Can I come in for a moment? That won't work. You can use the portal soon, but first, you have to do something for me. Here! What's this? Another remote? Yes! It's Leibold's. It seems to be an older model, but hey, I know how to use a remote. Yeah, <laughs> of course you do. Leibold is the fat one, right? I'm only asking because I haven't seen an implant. You can do it. When you're finished, you can use the portal. Then I'll explain everything. Huh? What portal? Trust me, and not a word to Yanosh. Whew, good thing I have a perfect memory. One little mistake, and I'd have an invalid timeline. But what happens next? Hmm. Huh. One shouldn't live in the past anyway. Okay.
So we've done that, and... Oh, brother. Alright, let's use the crowbar. We now have... Well then, let's do it. Cool. Now what? Now Rufus comes through. Ah, yes. There you are at last. What took you so long? Just because you're from the past doesn't mean there's no need to hurry. Huh? What's going on here? Is that you, Cletus? Don't be silly. I'm your future self, of course. These portals are space-time curvatures. And this is the future. Da, 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 da. They, they call, call him, him Rufus. Rufus. Hey, that's my jingle. Not anymore. I'm more up-to-date, wiser, and way cooler than you. Is that so? Huh, I want proof. All right. Anything to make you shut up. A simple test will show that you're nothing but a puffed-up loudmouth. Or you, exactly. So, what am I thinking of right now? All right. No, no, wait, wait. I remember now. You're thinking of... Zeeble Zooble. Zeeble Zooble. Ha! Missed it by a mile, you clown. Zeeble Zooble. <laughs> that doesn't even make sense. You're an imposter. I knew that right away. No, I'm not. I had to say that so I wouldn't create a time paradox. Yeah, yeah, right. Just admit that I won. Why? Why? What were you thinking of if it wasn't Zeeble Zooble? Well, actually, it was... Uh... <clears throat> Hey, <laughs> future me, old pal, there you are! How's that for a surprise? I told you so. Can we finally get going now? You need to go in there and rescue Gold. So she's really in there? Is she all right? Don't panic. Wink and Nod have been put out of action. What? You overwhelmed them both all by yourself? That was nothing. Looks like you're really me after all. How did you pull that off? Da, yo, you'll soon figure it out yourself. Meanwhile, I'm going to take care of the Rebels. Okay. Whoa, is that really a gun? No, it's a banana peeler. Of course it's a gun. Can I try it? Not now. You're headed to the lab. You need to free Goal, remember? Oh, well, I'll go rescue Goal then. I'm sure I'll do it way cooler than you did, and she'll end up being much freer than she did with you. Please do it just as cool as I did, or I'm going to dissolve. And that is really painful, you know? <laughs> Me like. Rufus! Yeah, yeah, I know. Spoil sport. But afterwards, I'll get the gun, right? Yes, sure! Yeah, right. Put him through the portal. Yeah, okay. And hurry, the clock's about to strike the hour here, and then the rebels will storm the office. All right, what a hero. I'm going to be someone. Yeah, what a moron. Who does he think he is? But now back to the mission at hand. The clock could strike the hour at any moment now, and then I'll be ready. <laughs> All I need now is a little patience, and nobody beats me at that. Patience. Yeah. Now, that's enough. Strike, will ya? Oh, come on, strike! <laughs> Ouch. But you hear that? The clock is striking with error. And right on the spot. It's time for your grand entrance, darling. Uh, the voice really has to. Quick question. Usually, it's you who here to block paper scissors. But usually, it's only about who fetches a fresh bag of chips. Stop trying to make excuses. One for all, and today, the one is you. Rufus, what are you doing here? There's been a change of plan. Goal is going to hang on to the Ascension Codes. Turning against the Resistance. Whose side are you on, then? Always on the winning side. Yeah, well, sometimes. What the... It's jammed? Yeah. Ah! Tough luck! Or not. Rufus? Haha, <laughs> very good. You made it on your own. Come with me. It's not over yet. Uh, wait a second. But, Goal, we haven't got time now for, for that kind of thing. I mean, shouldn't we wait until you're, you know, back in shape? Oh well, why not? You know, you really need to shave. <laughs> Let's go. Mm. 
Okay. I did it! See? I told you I could! Doc, why are you still trussed up? Lady Gore was supposed to untie you. But she didn't. She escaped to the future through the portal. She did what? Uh, oh, uh, no. no problem. Spunky Gore is still outside in Lee Bold's body. She'll make Lady Gore see reason. That wasn't Spunky Gore. That was a cleaning cartridge for my video recorder. The other two goals are still in the machine. Lee Bold doesn't even have an implant. But, but, but the remote! Uh, ah. Oh, oh my. That means I just... Rufus! What have you done to Gorleth and to Liebold? He seems to be quite distressed. Uh, a case of mistaken identity? I... Hey! Goal! What's this all about? I am sorry, Rufus. I just have to make one more change to your plan, I'm afraid. What? Huh? Change my plan? Yes. Once again, it's complicated, just like everything that involves you. You cause nothing but chaos. But I'm not made for that. I can no longer stay with you. Oh, come on. What brought this on? Open up! Don't even try. The door is bolted. I need a little head start if I want to find Cletus. Cletus? But what are you talking about? We were going to go to Elysium together, save the world and all that. It just doesn't work that way, Rufus. You can't let everybody down and still be the hero. That's impossible. Hey, impossible is my middle name. You said it. It appeals to you, doesn't it? You always want what's impossible, and therefore you will never be content. You can't come to Elysium, Rufus, because you carry Deponia within you. Farewell, trash baby. But wait a sec! Alright, let's find out. But where's the problem? Why can't we save Deponia and still go to Elysium together? Because it is mutually exclusive, Rufus. But it isn't. I know I can do it. This is about what you don't know. Have you ever asked yourself why they want to blow up Deponia? What's that got to do with anything? Everything, really. Elysium isn't the paradise you think it is. It is just a vessel, a starship, designed to leave Deponia once and for all, so that we can start over on Utopia, the nearest inhabitable planet. But Utopia is far away. There is only one possibility of generating enough energy to catapult Elysium there. The destruction of Deponia. What was that? Elysium is... what? A... Uh, a starship? Now do you finally understand? If Deponia is not blown up, then Elysium will soon fall back to the planet. We cannot live forever without a home planet. But Deponia is no place to live. We both know that. Hmm. Okay, I think I understand now, but... But what? But there must be a way. But there must be a way! There are even two ways. One leads to Elysium, and from there, onto Utopia. The other one ends here on Deponia, if we survive, that is. I have made my decision, Rufus. Now, it's up to you. Okay. There has to be a way to accomplish both! Trust me, I can fix everything! Just like you managed to fix me! All I want is a second chance! You had your chance, Rufus. Deponia had its chance. Sometimes things are actually broken beyond repair. You can keep the other two cartridges. They contain nothing but doubts and silly ideals. I can't use those where I'm bound. I've got to hurry! Donna Submersible awaits. If I don't make it to Porta Fisco with Cletus by the day after tomorrow, it will be too late. Good luck, Rufus. But... <sighs> what a woman. Mm. Are you out of your mind? She's going to kill us all. I think she's fascinating. Most importantly, she appears to be the part that knows the Ascension Codes. We must stop her somehow. But we're locked in. First, untie me. And then we'll think of something. Oh, there yeah. is always a way. Yeah, like you need to tell me that. 
Oh, boy. Malevolent karma, so close to the drama. Scrawls fresh doubts in her horse disarray. And she left him behind, though still not in one mind. Planning to reunite with her fierce fiancé. But if you think it's time for a fuss to resign, so close to the finish line, you don't know him at all. For heroes gather momentum on the brink of the maggot on a squall by the squall. They put balls to the wall. Okay, so now we have another act. <laughs> oh. All right. What the hell do we just do? Rufus. Mm. Ah, there you are. Ready for Shishash? Uh, Janos, there really isn't a whole lot of room on the trawler, and, uh... Yes, it's a shame I can't come. I would love to fight on the front line, side by side, like way back then. Way back then? Well, early today then, but alas, it's not possible. <laughs> I have a mission of my own. Uh-huh, well, that takes precedence, of course. Mm -hmm. At this point, our organization is simply not large enough to take on the Organon. You think so? Therefore, I too will travel to Porto Fisco. I'm in contact with the group there that has also taken up the fight against oppression. The passage is already booked. We are going to establish the resistance shell north, right under the nose of the Organon. How does that sound? Uh, good luck? Thanks. By the way, I must ask you a favor in this context. When you are in Porto Fisco, you must definitely pay us a fish it. I'm certain that people will want to meet the spiritual father of the movement. We'll see. Here, you're going to need this. What no. is it? We have agreed on a new secret knock. Eh, well, the old one was a piece of crap. Exactly. Nobody was really able to memorize it. Hmm. You know, Janosch, I've really got to go. Yes. Time for you to leave. Adventure is calling! So it is. It's calling. Will you finally shut up, you numbskull? <laughs> All right. At last, what kept you? Ah, uh, we'll never catch up to the submersible this way. It's not my fault. I was harassed by some bum. Where are we going, anyway? My Donna self mentioned Portofisco, so that's where we should go. I think we should first try to locate the signal from the submersible. I seem to remember there's a radio mast on Isla Watch It. Perhaps I can manipulate the transmitter so that our sonar will recognize the signature of the submersible. By then, Donna will be long gone. No thanks. I say Isla Watch It. Bozo is the captain, and he wants to go to Fisco too, right? We can head for the polar ice cap, as far as I'm concerned. Just as long as you finally agree on something. Enough! I will decide where we're going. Uh, Rufus, those aren't the navigation controls. That's oh. my ear hair remover. Ah. Okay. Alright, so now we have a bunch of places we have to go. And this is unknown. That's unknown. Okay, floating black market, port of Fes Fisco, and two unknowns. Alright. Okay, well, right now, let's see. We should visit Porto Fisco first. We should visit Port. Okay. Um. Now, let's see if that. Do I need to get something? Uh oh, 
the Organons. Today is not your lucky day, Seagull. Oh. My people rummaged through every pile of garbage, but they found no trace of the girl. She was here. Why would I lie to you? I don't know. You appear to suffer from an inflated ego, just like your son. Rufus is not my son. You can do whatever you want with him, but we had a deal. You oh. wanted a tip, and I gave you one. Can I help it if your people are totally incompetent? You are wasting my time. Whoa! And I can't stand it when my time is being wasted. Hey you, tone it down a bit. You're scaring the fish. I'm sorry, it won't happen again. I want every nook and cranny of this junk pile turned inside out once more and close off oh. all access to the harbor. Even if a rat tries to get out of here, I want to know. Okay. That was Argus with his bloodhounds. So the Organon is already after us. Shh. He's right. We need to be careful. Hey, what do you think you're doing? I'm, uh, I'm uh, b bowing before Neptune. Or, uh, isn't that him? What? Where? Are you mocking me? Mocking, robbing, something like that, yeah. Ugh. Okay. Ooh. I just had a sniz. Alright. Well, this area's off limits now. So we need to go to. All right. All right. So we gotta get to the. Did we go to the North Pole or? Lousy weather. We should make sure we finish up here as quickly as possible. The crust on my overcoat is starting to dissolve. Yeah, I don't know if this is where I wanted to go. Alright, let's... Ah, is the watch it, so this will be the North Pole. Okay. What? That's supposed to be the pole? Lonzo puts more ice in the drinks when he wants to save alcohol. What a disappointment. Mm. This could be useful. I'll take it. So now I have what? Ice? Okay. Hose. Bait fish. Secret knock note. The sign is bigger than the pole. Huh. Hmm. Okay. I'm gonna take care of some things here and then we're gonna go back to Isla Watch It. Careful. Tea's hot. Did I just hear a challenge? No, I... Oh! Ouch! Ooh! Darn it. I warned you. Well, I have a way to cool the tea down. What are you making? Iced tea. The tea was against the cold. So, I don't believe in wasting food. And I still had to watch you throw away the fries I stuck up your nose during the night. Okay. Now it should be all right. Don't do it. The tea is... Hot? Hardly. No, I mean it's also... Weak. Uh-oh. Weak. Ah! 
It's true what they say. You just can't stop the melting at the poles. Oh, God. All right. Well, we could use that torch. I'm sure he won't mind. <coughs> yeah, he won't mind. He's dead. All right. So let's see here what we're doing here on our hunting down a submarine. Okay. Track down the submarine. Find his little watch. It's radio tower. Find the broken transmitter. Fix it. Reattach the transmitter. Board the submarine. Bring Lady Gold to terms. Perform surgery on Gold yet again. So this is going to be tricky. All right. Hello? What the hell? Uh, oh, come on! Of course. Okay, that's what I've done. All right, I gotta do something here. There we go. All right, so let's get back in. We'll head over to Isla Watch It. All right, so we're only gonna have a brief time here in Isla Watch It. <laughs> Okay, let's head over here. Because gold went in there. Oh. I found the problem. The transmitter is broken. Then what are we waiting for? Off to dock with it. Yep. Okay. How do I get off the screen now? Ah, here. All right. Let's get back to the trawler goal. All right. Let's try you on the radar. But what are you doing there? I'm extending the range of the radar. But not like that. The transmitter has to go back on the radio mast. Oh. oh yeah? And how do you explain that? <laughs> hmm. That could be due to the mushrooms in the casserole. Even though I scraped those fresh off the bow? Okay. <laughs> well, let's take this to Doc. Come on, Doc. I went to the radio mast. The transmitter is broken. How do you know? Oh, I found it lying at the foot of the radio antenna. It's fried. So it is. You're right. Oh, I know a fried piece of electronics when I see one. Even when your signature is missing? Can you repair it? I already did. Well, why did you take so long? Mainly because of the lollipop stick that was stuck between the contacts. At any rate, the device is working now. All you need to do is mount it at the top of the radio mast. Easy peasy. All right, well, we don't have the ability to do that. But what we're gonna do, we're gonna go to Porta Frisco, Fisco, and then we're gonna save the game and call it an episode there. We'll get tired of seeing this after a while. Or we won't see it that often from this point on. So we're gonna call it an episode here. So. That's Porta Fisco, the former metropolis of the Rust Red Sea. A real dump, even by Deponian standards. And yeah. what is that awful stench? All right, so we'll call an episode here. And as you can see, okay, we got... 
because as you can see now, all we have, we've achieved these and we just have to re reattach it. But we're going to have to figure out all this. But we can do that next time. As always, this is Rich Kale here on YouTube, Rich Gen X elsewhere. I invite you to subscribe to the channel and check out everything that I am working on. That premieres at 3 p.m. Eastern every day. Uh, besides this, I am working my way through other franchises and series and games. Um, working my way through the King's Quest franchise. I'm going to be starting King's Quest 7, The Princeless Bride. Uh, working my way through uh, the Doom franchise, following Doom Guys, I assume Doom Slayer, currently on Doom 2016. Working my way through Beyond Good and Evil. Working my way through the Tomb Raider Core Designs timeline, currently on the last game of that franchise, that part of the franchise, Angel of Darkness. I'm working my way through Ca uh, Sherlock Holmes Chapter 1. And as of the date I'm recording this, the second second game in the rebooted Sherlock Holmes timeline is released, and I will follow that up when the time comes. I'm working my way through the Aliens Isolation DLC. I think there's only two extra missions. I already did one, so this will be the second one that will be coming up. I'm working my way, also working my way through the original Sherlock Holmes timeline in a chronological order. I'm actually on the final game, in, well, the first game that was released, the seventh in the timeline, The Mystery of the Mummy. And there's a bunch of other things that premieres at 3 p.m. Eastern every day. Also at 10 a.m. Tuesday through Saturday, I have videos premiering. Tuesday's usually a fic reading. Wednesday is one of the first five, one of the first seven Final Fantasy games. I think I'm still on seven right now. Thursday is usually a Dead by Daylight game. Friday is uh, Finding Game Ladder Mode, and Saturday is usually for a retrospective for a game or series I've beaten. So until then, take care all, and have fun. Bye!